Hi, I'm Dr. Randy Walcott and I'm a wound care provider in Lubbock, Texas. We have a fairly large clinic. I get to see a lot of patients every day and uh, it has really helped my practice, helped my patients, improved our outcomes by uh, understanding biofilm's role in the chronic wound. Early on, we, we were like any other wound care provider. We believed that bacteria made some sort of difference in the outcomes of wounds. Uh, we were using the antimicrobial dressings, we were using antibiotics, and yet our key opinion leaders were telling us that, that the, the microbes didn't matter on the surface of the wound, that you, know, you could culture them, you could treat them, but it wouldn't affect the outcomes. And that wasn't true in certain individual patients, and yet we knew that there was something out, there was a piece of the puzzle missing. How did that do that? Uh, how did the bacteria impair the wound healing? Uh, it got linked up with Bill Costerton uh, through uh, finding some material on the internet and stuff. At the CBE, Garth James, Bill Costerton, they were very gracious. The other, Phil Stewart, they were all... Uh, very helpful and very interested that, that we understood what biofilm was and uh, very interested in where that would lead us uh, in medicine. Uh, so we did some early studies and, and basically the question was, uh, is a chronic wound a chronic infection? Uh, we, uh, we did the, the, the microscopic uh, evaluation of about 50 chronic wounds and found that there was biofilm in the, in the majority of wounds. Not saying that there was a biofilm in the rest of the wounds, okay, but we could, if we could clearly identify biofilm structures in 60%. Uh, my, my suspicion was, even at that time, that chronic wounds behaved chronically or acted the way they did because of the presence of biofilm. So, you know, it was a big deal. It, it was now a new, important barrier for, for when I walked into the room to take care of that, that, that patient. It became a very important part of my thinking and, and my strategies for managing that wound. This panel was, uh, and several people have said that, and I want to echo this statement. This is the best group of, the, uh, of scientists, clinicians, and, I, and I've been a part of a bunch. Uh, this is the most uh, uh, open uh, and uh, the the, uh, the most collegial uh, group. <laughs> Uh, and it was clear that every single person was, was uh, interested in finding out what is, you know what is the reality here. What, what you know based on the scientific evidence that comes out of their experiments, out of our experience in the uh, in the clinic. Uh, what role does biofilm play in, in uh, the non-healing or the poor outcomes in wounds? And, and, and it, it was clear from all the information that, that we reviewed and. Uh, the, the science that was cited here, uh, the, the biofilm is a major barrier in why chronic wounds uh, uh, do not heal and, and behave the way they do.